As the U.S. enters its fourth month battling coronavirus, a debate is growing as to whether a fourth relief package is needed. Ray Bogan has the latest on what the Trump administration says should be done. New York City is officially in phase three of reopening in the midst of coronavirus. It's an important step since Governor Cuomo first declared a disaster emergency March 7th. I understand people are fatigued. It doesn't change the facts and we have to stay smart. As things slowly get back to normal, the Treasury Department is releasing data showing the Paycheck Protection Program has so far supported 51.1 million jobs. Nearly 4.9 million loans have been distributed, worth more than $521 billion. The Senate Minority Leader said of the data, more transparency is still needed to ensure that these taxpayer dollars went where Congress intended. The PPP is a popular CARES Act program that was just extended until August 8th. But another benefit that expires July 31st has not been renewed, 600 extra dollars a week in unemployment insurance. Labor Secretary Eugene Scalia says it may not be needed going forward. The Congressional Budget Office has said that um, uh, I think four out of five people currently on unemployment would get more from unemployment uh, if we continued that $600 benefit. Congress is on recess for the next two weeks. So far, another coronavirus package is a ways off. But there are ideas on what could be included. The payroll tax is something of great interest to the president because it would help um, low, low and middle income Americans most. Senate Majority Leader Mitch McConnell says when the Senate comes back into session July 20th, they'll turn their attention to coronavirus relief.